afternoon and welcome to this edition of Rowland Sports. We're coming to you from Russell High School and doing a couple interviews with the players on their women's basketball team, the Lady Red Devils. And with me here is Bella Quinn. And Bella, it's good to good to be here with you. First off, um, talk about the talk about your summer. You've played with the West Virginia Thunder, and um, you've been really really worked on your game a lot. I saw you play a couple times at Raceland, and talk about what you've been doing this summer and how you how your training has been going. Well, I've done CrossFit with the team some, and obviously training on my own, and with Shaylin, which pushes me to be better, obviously. And really just working on different parts of my game, just like, so I'm not just shooting and I can attack the basket, my defense, just getting stronger. Mm -hmm. You were handling the ball a lot more, um, running the points some. How has that, how has that felt compared to, to prior years, which I know um, even though you'll play the two quite a bit, you've been training some to play point as well? Yeah, and that also gives Shaylin a break so she can like, so I can help handle and run the point and just set up our offense some, and it can just help me score better. Mm -hmm. And talk about your team and, and what you have. I know it was a, um, a tough finish the last season, but um, as usual, you were in contention, and you, you all sure have a lot coming back this year. Yeah, we have most of the team back besides Campbell, obviously. But we're going to be way younger with the kids coming up, but they can help us a lot still. And we just need to keep everyone healthy so we have a stable starting five again. Mm -hmm. And talk about your your shooting. One one thing I noticed is, of course, a couple of years ago you had a run where, I mean, you shot nearly 50% that season and you shot well last year also. Um, talk about what, talk about your method and what runs through your mind. And Well, I don't really think about it too much. I kind of just know I need to make shots and when I get it, I just shoot it and try to shoot open shots and just the best ones I can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and defensively, um, you know, defensively you've had a, a strong run as well. Um, talk about talk about that and um, you're because I know that's that's been an area you've contributed heavily and um, talk about the importance of playing good good defense for the team. Well, our defense will turn it into good offense and transition and getting to push the ball. And just when I create a lot of pressure on defense, it helps our teammates get like active and get us going. Mm -hmm. And talk about this, you know, and I asked Shaylin the same question, but how it feels to you. You've you've played basketball, of course, since very young. And um, for, for me, my first time seeing you was um, actually the first game I called a couple years ago when you were in eighth grade. And um, you went against the Ashland seniors that year. Ashland's had his heavy senior-laden team. And... Um, and you you scored four points, but fearlessly attacked the, the older players. And talk about now how it feels. You've grown. You've I mean you've come leaps and bounds on your game. And talk about how it feels now being one of the one of the older players on the team and and leadership. Well, it feels good because I know that the younger kids can look up to me, and I just want to set a good example for them, and just to lead our team to region and just to get good wins. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And and for the for the fans to to get to know you a little bit better off the court, talk about maybe something like do you have a hobby or something in your spare time that that you enjoy enjoy doing in particular when you're not on the basketball court? Well, other than basketball, I like playing tennis because it kind of it's a sport that just gets your mind off everything, and it's not a lot of pressure like basketball, and it's just a fun sport. Mm -hmm. um, talk about the the tennis team this year, and talk about your talk about your experience playing tennis, and and what it's been like for you. Well, this was my first year playing tennis, and I played doubles the whole year. And at first, it was just something different. I kind of had to get used to it, but we got better throughout the year. And my doubles partner, we beat Ashland in region, and then we qualified for state and. So that was both of our first years playing, and we got to go to state, which was a really good experience. So, wow, that's that's great. Where did they where did they play the state tournament? Um, it's in Lexington at Top Seed, and there's outdoor courts and then indoor courts, and then the boys play at Kentucky, and then it switches every year. Oh, nice, nice. Well, Bella, we appreciate you being on today. And lastly, do you have any 
Any shout outs you'd like to give? Uh, yeah, I'd like to shout out your cat, Bella. You know, big fan. I just, <laughs> that's all, really. Nice. Yeah, sounds good. All right, well, Bella, we thank you for being on today, and be sure to stay tuned. We'll see see more more episodes with this this women's basketball team at Russell. They got to the regional semifinals last year and, and are expected to be good once again this year to make a potential run at state. So it'll be exciting to watch, and we thank you for tuning in today from watching Rolling Sports, where you meet the athletes.